Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Now we move on explaining the word postmodernism. I'm going to give you an exhaustive overview of this art term through four parts definition, characteristics, origins, and comparisons between postmodernism and modernism. Now we shall begin with the definition. According to Cambridge Dictionary, Postmodernism is a style of art, writing, music, theaters, and especially architecture popular in the West in the 1980s and 1990s that excludes pictures from several different periods in the past or from the present and past. According to Art term, Postmodernism is a reaction against the ideas and values of modernism as well as discussion of the periods that followed modernism's dominance in cultural theory and practiced in the early and middle decades of the 20th century. So what are the characteristics of postmodernism? Now we move on to the second part. Postmodernism is characterized by self-referentiality, moral relativism, pluralism, irony, irreverence and it rejects the universal validity, stable identity, hierarchy, and categorization. The primary features of postmodernism typically include the ironic play with stars, suggestions, narrative levels, and metaphysical skepticism, with a preference for the virtuous at the expense of the real. Let's dig deeper in the origins of the term. The basic features of what is now called postmodernism can be found as early as the 1940s, most notably in the book of artists such as George Louis Borges. However, most scholars today agree postmodernism began to compass with modernism in the late 1950s and gained ascendancy over it in the 1960s. Since then, postmodernism has been a powerful force in art, literature, film, music, drama, architecture, and history. The architects and theorists Robert Venturi play an important role in the history of the field as one of the first authors to write on the subjects of postmodernism in his book. Complexity and Contradiction in the Architecture, which was published in 1966. When we compare postmodernism with modernism, postmodernism describes not only a period, but also a set of ideas and can only be understood in relation to another equally complex term, modernism. The post in postmodernism suggests after. Postmodernism is the best understood as a set of the ideas and values associated with a form of modernism that believes in progress and innovation. Modernism insists on a clear divide between art and popular culture. Modernism is all about change, changes, and ideas coming from other minds, so it's very creative. Why postmodernism is everything changed by the media, so it's less creative. For illustration, modernism focuses on writers, while postmodernism focuses on the reader. Modernism is an unreliable narrator, whereas postmodernism is an ironic narrator. Why modernism uses idiosyncratic language. Postmodernism uses simple language. So I have just explained the words postmodernism and I hope that it will be of some help to you. Thanks for watching.